as you can see, I'm on a Chromebook. Um, here's the cute little Chrome icons I've got. The particular Chromebook I'm using is a Samsung Chromebook Plus version one, and it's got an octa-core ARM-based processor. And in this video, I will show you how to install um, the software center where you can find all the packages that are available to your uh, ARM-based thing. And that's going to be through uh, Linux. And we're going to walk through all of that. Um, you're just going to want to make sure that you have Linux enabled. So if you go to set, you can look up Linux and you just want to make sure that your Linux is enabled and that'll give you access to the term. And that's what we're going to take advantage of in this video. You'd be able to see all types of packages you can get for your Chromebook. I like to use mine as a developer. So you get all these IDEs that you're uh, able to use. Today I'm going to show you how to install the Linux uh, software center on a Chromebook that's ARM based so that you can install packages that will work for your Chromebook on Linux. So first we're going to so first we're going to copy this command in sudo apt get gnome software center gnome package kit and you hit yes Make sure you get that all going. Might take a while, depending on your computer. It's just gonna unpackage all of those. So after that's finished, you're gonna want to run sudo apt git update. That's just going to download some updates for your Chromebook. And that might take a minute. And then the last one you're going to want to run is sudo apt git dist upgrades. That'll upgrade your distribution. And that's going to be a little bit bigger. Then when that's all done, you're going to want to restart your Chromebook so that these changes can take effect. Okay, so once you've restarted your once you've restarted your Chromebook, you can come here to the launcher and you can search software and then open up the software. And this should be the Linux Software Center with uh, things that are compatible with your Chromebook. So you can do developer tools. You can look under this category and you've got all of these IDEs you can look up and use and install on your Chromebook. And it's pretty cool. I like Spider. We could install Spider for Python 3 development. Yeah, and you've got all of that on your Chromebook now. So you can do um, whatever you want. You can install Linux-based games. Um, types of fun emulators you can have and it's all for free because it's Linux and open source. If you guys have liked this video please give it a thumbs up and like and subscribe.